So, willkommen zurück. Wir laufen jetzt wieder runter. Da ist noch ein Creeper. <lacht> Nein, ein Keeper. Und jetzt wollte ich mal eine Runde reisen. Back. Wards, Access, MCs, Concert Chambers, Financial District. Geht mal zu den Chambers. Tada! Gut, gut, gut. Was haben wir denn hier schönes? Ich mal ein bisschen rum, vielleicht finde ich ein paar Keeper, die ich noch nicht gescannt habe. Natürlich ultra spannend, ich weiß, aber irgendwann muss ich es machen. Und dann mache ich es lieber jetzt. Dann nehmen wir uns die spannenden Sachen für später auf. So. So ist auch mein Lieblingswort hier geworden. Aber das haben wir schon früher festgestellt. Okay, okay, okay. Udinas Office, genau, er war der Ambassador. Ja gut, wenn ich schon hier bin, dann gehe ich mal in die Richtung. Sie sind mal für dich. Keine Tür. Keine für mich benutzbare Tür. Wollten mal wieder auf Kugel kommen. Hm, ich gehe erstmal an das Office. Ich hoffe mal, hier ist hier nicht so viel passiert. Strange greeting, human. This is really not a good time. You seem distressed. Is there something I can do to help? Alarmed response. You overheard that, did you? This is all going so wrong. And it is the Asari consort's fault. She's the one who started all this. So to den gemacht. What did this Asari do to get you so upset? I cannot speak more about this problem. It is too sensitive. Suffice it to say, she has compromised my authority as a diplomat. Where can I find this Asari consort? She is across the bridge from here. Her offices are easy enough to spot. Good day, human. Mm, auch das kommt mir irgendwie bekannt vor. Well, the new Earth Clan Spectre. Obviously, you are already lost. Your ambassador is next door. Chastising remark. Don't be so rude, Dan. At least introduce yourself. I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Is there something I can do for you, Earth Clan? Yeah. You seem to have a bit of a chip on your shoulder, Din. You humans are new to the Citadel, and yet the Council has granted you great favor. <sighs> Chastising rebuke, Din. Your species has always been granted many concessions. Bolus territory has expanded tenfold since coming to the Citadel. <laughs> Details. We still have no real say in the decisions that affect Citadel space. What next? What is it you do here? I look out for the best interests of the Volus people. No easy task considering how often we are overlooked by the Council. Chastising rebuke, Dan. The Council favors your species greatly. You are naive. The Earth Clan will be invited to the Council long before our species will. Why aren't the Volus or Elcor part of the Council? All species must prove themselves before they join the Council. All but the Earth Clans, it would seem. Dismissive. Ignore the Volus Ambassador, human. He is incorrect in his assessment. Really? How long have we been waiting? How long do you think we'll continue to wait? 
Bah! This talk is wasted on the humans. Ah, jetzt wird wieder mal voller Lob für uns Menschen. I'd like to know more about the Volus. I'm sure our history and culture would bore you, Earth Clan. No, ja, erzähl mal was. Actually, I would like to know more about your history. My people came to the Citadel shortly after the Asari and Salarians had discovered it. We were instrumental in establishing a standardized galactic economy. However, despite our long association with the Citadel and our many contributions to galactic society, we still do not hold a seat on the Council. Schade. Schade, 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 schade. Tell me about Volus culture. We are tribal by nature, but our ways are not violent. We barter and trade our lands and tribe members in order to increase status. Larger tribes often engulf smaller ones and eventually split again. Our society is very malleable, and our government is always shifting and changing. Since we're not physically adept, we trade our services for protection. What is this place? You are in the embassy for the Volus and the Elcor. Your ambassador is next door, in his own office. In this shared space, I aid my fellow Volus when I'm not being interrupted. Goodbye, ambassador. Yes, yes. Good day, Earth Clan. Vielleicht ist er jetzt nicht mehr ganz so angepisst. I can't tell the aliens from the animals. So much empty space. A thousand of my people could live here and hardly even see each other. Ja, stimmt. Die Quarianer, ähm, wie ich ja von sagte, wurden ja von den Geth von ihrem Planeten vertrieben. Seitdem leben die eben in Raumschiffen in der Flotte, genannt Flotilla. Und ja, auf engstem Raum ganz viele Leute eben. Da? Wo ist er denn? Wo ist er denn? Wo ist er denn? Hm. The new? The new. Hallo? Das war komisch. Ich war schon mal, ich weiß noch nicht, ob ich den nicht scannt habe. Okay, habe ich. Dann gehen wir darüber. So, they finally did it. I knew one of your kind would make Spectre one day. I only hope you're better than the one they're sending you after. Ich versuche besser zu sein. I'll do everything I can to stop Saren. Hm. That's what worries me. Was there something you wanted? Yep. I get the feeling you're not too fond of humans. No, I just don't trust your kind. Not yet. You humans are eager to take all the power you can get, and you're being given a lot. If the council wants to make humanity their new favorite pet, that's their business. But I don't have to like it. Okay. I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. Hast du noch einen Käfer hier? Nö. 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 Dann hier lang. This place seems strange. I wish there were more humans around. I don't have time to talk now. Immer noch beschäftigt. Mensch. Gibt's doch nicht. Da war ich auch schon. Hm. Hm. 
Na dann, schauen wir mal hier lang. Oder ich gucke einfach mal, was ich noch machen muss. Okay, 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 okay. Wie gesagt, das habe ich nicht rausgekriegt hier, wo das Signal ist. Das muss ich vielleicht mal irgendwo nachlesen. Und die Hauptmission hier. Speak to the Ambassador. Das Alliance Stopping Bay. Central Elevator in Seasack Academy. Okay. Also muss ich zur Seasack Academy. Das scheint wohl der zu sein. Fahren wie der Fahrstuhl. In other news, Exogenicorp is still denying reports that one of their survey teams has gone missing in the Hades Gamma Cluster. When asked why communication with the survey team was suddenly cut off last week, company officials refused to comment. Keiner sagt was. Betretenes Schweigen. Und wir sind da. Kleinen Safe noch. Na, Taste. Jetzt. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. Das werde ich. Das werde ich, Captain. I'll take good care of her, sir. I know you will, Commander. Aber warum eigentlich? I want the truth. Why are you stepping down, sir? You needed your own ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Das hat aber schon noch einen Hintergrund. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. I was in your shoes 20 years ago, Shepard. They were considering me for the Spectres. Why didn't you ever mention this? What was I supposed to say? I could have been a Spectre, but I blew it. I failed, Commander. It's not something I'm proud of. Ask me later and I'll tell you the whole story. For now, all you need to know is, I was sent on a mission with Saren, and he made sure the Council rejected me. I had my shot. It came and went. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistakes. I won't let you down, sir. Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got us Geth scouring the traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Pharaoh system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact, and there have been sightings around Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Pharaohs and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. And you Reaper? The Reapers are the real threat. I'm with the Council on this one, Shepard. I'm not sure they even exist. But if they do exist... The conduit's the key to bringing them back. Stop Saren from getting the conduit, and we stop the Reapers from returning. But come on. I'll stop it. We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau cluster. You give it a mind. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. But your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. I'll try not to make things any harder on you, Ambassador. 
Glad to hear it, Commander. Remember, you were a human long before you were a Spectre. I have a meeting to get to. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Okay. Yes, Commander? I want to know the truth about you and Sarah. I want to know about the mission you were on together all those years ago. We had intel on a rogue scientist being funded by Batarian interests. He was trying to set up a facility to develop illegal AI technology out in the Verge. Alliance Intel had done all the work, but the Council wanted a Spectre involved. We compromised. I was assigned to help Saren in his investigation. We tracked the scientist to a refining facility on Kamala. He was hidden away somewhere inside, protected by an army of Batarian mercenaries. The plan was simple. Sneak into the plant, capture the scientist, sneak back out. Quick, quiet, and a minimum of bloodshed. I'm guessing things didn't go as planned. Saren and I split up to cover more ground. Then about halfway through the mission, there was a massive explosion in the refinery core. Officially, it was ruled an accident, but I think Saren detonated it on purpose to draw off the enemy guards. How many casualties? The explosion tore the refinery to shreds. The whole place was on fire. Black chemical clouds poured out into the atmosphere. Nobody inside survived. There was a camp for the workers and their families nearby. Between the fires and the toxic fumes, the final death count was over 500. Mostly civilians. Saren didn't care. The target was eliminated, mission accomplished, and I ended up taking the blame. That ended all talk of me joining the Spectres. Okay, Saren macht Mist and Anderson wird dafür beschuldigt. Hmm, cool. Saren caused the explosion. How did he pin it on you? In his report, Saren accused me of blowing his cover. He said it was my fault the guards were ready for us. He claimed that's why it turned into a massacre. Saren's report was all the proof the Council needed to kill my chances of becoming a Spectre. Don't blame yourself, Captain. I don't. I blame Saren. I think he wanted things to go bad. He was looking for an excuse to blow that refinery. Maybe he just likes the violence. Maybe he was just trying to make me look bad to keep humans out of the Spectres. If so, he pulled it off. Why'd you let him get away with it? Who do you think the Council was going to listen to? Me? Or their best agent? I had a bad feeling about him right from the start. I should have been more careful. Maybe I could have stopped things before they got out of hand. The only thing I care about is stopping Saren. You're right, Commander. It's no good living in the past. How are you holding up? Honestly, this isn't how I pictured my career coming to an end. Pushing papers really isn't my thing, but you're the one who can stop Saren. I believe in you, Shepard. If that means I have to step aside, so be it. Tell me what happened with you and Saren 20 years ago. It's close to 20 years ago now. Ambassador Goyle was our representative here on the Citadel. Like Udina, she wanted to get a human into the Spectres. She chose me. The Council sent Saren to keep an eye on me and evaluate my performance, just like they sent Nihilus to keep tabs on you. Why weren't you honest with me? It's not something I'm proud of. I had a chance to become the first human Spectre, and I failed. Saren made sure of that. I think I deserve the whole story. We had intel on a rogue okay, sign. Alliance intel had done all the work, but the Council wanted... We tracked the scientist to a roof. The plan was simple. Sneak into the plant, capture the scientist, sneak back out. The only thing I care about is stopping Saren. You're right, Commander. It's no good living in the past. Mm, that was some Artemis Tau cluster. What do you know about the Artemis Tau cluster? Not much. I've never been there myself. A handful of systems with a few small, uncharted worlds, but no real colonies. Might not be easy finding Dr. Tassoni out there. My advice is to look for the world with the Prothean ruins. And Pharos? Any extra intel you can give me on our colony at Pharos? The entire planet used to be one giant Prothean city. Mostly ruins now. But some of the infrastructure is still intact. The colony tried to build on what the Protheans left behind. We lost all contact with them when the Geth attacked. Cool. The alien stuff. What can you tell me about Novaria? Novaria's trouble. Always has been. 
The whole planet's basically a center for corporations to conduct illegal research. Watch your back there, Shepard. Spectres are about the only form of citadel authority Novaria respects. But they aren't popular. Okay, danke fürs Gespräch, Captain. I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. Tada. Ist da oben noch ein Kiebe? Ja. Yeah. Können wir noch ein bisschen Kohle abgreifen und Erfahrungspunkte. Ja, yeah. ausgezeichnet. Und dann geht's an Bord der Normandy. Endlich mal wieder. Vorerst genug auf der Citadel rumgegammelt. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. Things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Well, irgendwas stimmt da bestimmt nicht. Captain Anderson should be the one in charge. It's like I'm stealing the ship from him. Yeah, the captain got screwed. But it's not like you could have stopped it. Nobody's blaming you. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. Intercom's open. If you got anything you want to say to the crew, now's the time. Oh, Entschuldigung. Falter Knopf. This is Commander Shepard speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. I won't lie to you, crew. This mission isn't going to be easy. Um. For too long, our species has stood apart from the others. Now it's time for us to step up and do our part for the rest of the galaxy. Time to show them what humans are made of. This began with an attack on a human settlement in the Traverse. But we know Saren won't stop there. His Geth armies aren't going to stay on the far fringes of Citadel space. Our enemy knows we're coming. When we go into the Traverse, Saren's followers will be waiting for us. But we'll be ready for them, too. Humanity needs to do this. Not just for our own sake, but for the sake of every other species in Citadel space. Saren must be stopped. And I promise you all, we will stop him. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. The captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't fail. Yes, sir. Ja, und so werden Legenden geboren. Und wie es weitergeht, sehen wir beim nächsten Mal. Macht's gut.